The Lord Jesus tells a parable of a man who had a very great harvest. The harvest was so great that he had no room to store them. So he said to himself, I will put down my barn and build a greater barn. Then I will say to myself, that's him talking to himself, Saul, you have much goods laid up for many years. Take your ease, eat, drink, and be merry. But God said unto him, This night your soul shall be required of you. For a man's life does not consist of the abundance of things which he possesses, but in the richness of his relationship with the Lord God. In an attempt to sustain life, many people ignore the life giver and the ultimate sustainer of life. These, in some cases, driven by covetousness or the lack of contentment, work around the clock to sustain a life that they do not own. In the end, lay up treasures for themselves on earth, but in reality are dead to God. Now what separates the children of the world from the children of God is while those of the world are driven by the cares of this life, what to eat, what to drink, what to wear, etc. and much more, children of God endowed with eternal life seek or are driven by the interest or the will of their king while their king, the Lord Jesus, empowers and sustains their lives.